Hey y'all. Oh my God. It looks so weird without everything here, right? It looks so weird without everything here. Oh my God. It looks so bad. How y'all doing? First of all, I want to shout out my girl Rita. Look what she got me. Look at the gift she got me, y'all. A bunch of spicy jalapeno chips. They the little ones too. I told her I can stuff them in my bag when I get on a plane. You know what I'm saying? Because sometimes they only give me snack. Mm. Mm-hmm. Sometimes on the plane, you know what I mean? It'd be a little. Where them ruffles chips at? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, yeah. Let's stop some of these, you know what I mean? They small size. Well, I can fit these in my bag when I go to TSA, you know they better not say a damn thing neither. Mm-hmm. They better not tell me I can't have no chip because I read the rules. <laughs> I can bring my chips on the on the plane. Yeah, mm-hmm. You already got on me about my perfume. I had to pack my perfume. Cause y'all be trying to take a bitch perfume. You ain't taking my perfume. It costs too much money. How y'all doing though? It's 10 o'clock. It's October 2nd. This is your collective reading for October 2nd, 2024. Thank you to Rita for getting me my chips for my birthday. That's the best birthday gift ever. Some chips. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what's going on with the collective? <laughs> I'm in a good mood. I don't know why. You know, sometimes you're just real happy. Maybe because I'm getting out of this apartment. <laughs> just happy. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm happy. It's good to just be happy. You don't always need a reason to be happy. Just be happy. You're alive. You woke up. Got food to eat. Something to drink. Got fresh water. Realizations. Epiphanies. Understandings. Awakenings. Obscurity. Secrets. Mysteries. Concealing. Withdrawn, single, lonely, solitary, pride, arrogance, ego, stubborn. Who this? It says epiphanies, understandings, awakenings, secrets, mysteries, concealing, withdrawn. Mm. Seem like you pulled back from somebody. You feel like this person was either hiding something or they was acting too secretive. Either they was acting too secretive or you felt like they was hiding something. I found so many decks today, y'all. When I was packing, I said, oh my God, even though I had these decks. So y'all gonna see me bust out with a lot of decks that you ain't never seen me use before. I was like, oh my God, I didn't even know I had these decks in the closet. I found so many new tarot decks. I cannot wait to use them. This is one of them. So let's see what's going on with the collective. I should have used this one to clarify, but because it's small, but it's okay. What's going on with you and this person? Somebody's name is Walter, Omar, Perry, Abe. What's going on with you and this person? The two of cups in reverse. Damn. First card. Yeah, you definitely cut somebody off. You definitely pull back from somebody. The hermit just tried to pop out. Some of you got Virgo here. The Emperor. This person could be an Aries. Yeah. Yeah, you definitely pull back from somebody. And did. <laughs> okay. Ooh, 
Some of y'all, this is same sex. That's not for all of you. Excuse me. Bottom of the deck, the six of pentacles. Okay. Some of you felt like this person was like breadcrumbing you. I definitely feel like there's somebody else around them because there's two queens here. So I definitely feel like there's somebody else around them. I don't know if that's why you pull back. You just felt like this person was making things too difficult. They was making things too hard. I do see communication still coming from them. I mean, I don't know if you want to hear from them or not, but you felt like this affected the connection. You felt like the connection was way stronger. You're not putting in no type of effort anymore. You feel like they didn't put in enough effort anyway themselves. Let's see. Make sure you guys hit that like button. Comment, subscribe, share. Tell a friend. You don't trust this person. What's the two of cups in reverse? Somebody's last name is White. The Ace of Swords. Some of y'all, it's something this person said. Something they said that made you pull back. What's the Queen of Swords in reverse? The Knight of Cups. The crazy thing is you do have feelings for them. You do have feelings for them. Five of Pentacles, but you just felt like you had to go cold on them. You do have feelings for them. You do. Don't look at me like that. Some of y'all feel like this person got mother issues. What's the emperor? The lovers in reverse. The two of pentacles. Yeah, this person, five of pentacles. This person is definitely talking to somebody else. Some of y'all, maybe you found that out or maybe you just picked up on that intuitively because you do have the realizations card, which says epiphanies, understandings, and awakening. So there's some type of realization you had about this person. They definitely talking to somebody else. I don't think they're in love with this person, but they are dealing with another person. What's the eight of pentacles in reverse? They actually miss you. If you're not talking to them right now, they miss you. Yeah, they miss you. Um, they still feel a lot of attraction towards you. Yeah, Page of Pentacles in reverse, Ace of Wands. They do miss you a lot with the Five of Cups. Who is this other person that's around them? The Queen of Pentacles in reverse? Yeah, the Queen of Wands in reverse, the Sun in reverse. Whoever this other person is, they don't want this person like that. This person is coming up as the queen of wands in reverse. They're not even cute. I'm not even trying to make you feel bad. I mean, feel good, but this could be somebody from their past that <laughs> be lingering around. Could be a Leo. The sun is in reverse. So it's like this person don't even really make them happy. I don't see a connection with them. The strength, yes, yeah, it took strength for you to pull back and stop talking to this person, focus on yourself. That's what you've been doing. Um, Leo energy here. I feel like this hasn't been easy for you because you got a lot of feelings for them. See, the star is here. Aquarian energy. See, the sun in reverse. Yeah, I feel like I just heard boundaries, like you had to set boundaries. The star, the sun in reverse, you, it's like you had a lot of hope and you had a lot of faith in this connection. You did. But this person just wasn't making you happy. 
And you you don't want to be stressed because some of y'all, maybe this situation was stressing you out with the nine of swords in reverse. Some of you were losing sleep over this. This person is going to message you. They've been thinking about you a lot. <laughs> you got the eight of swords and the five of swords in reverse. They've been thinking about you a lot. You've been on their mind a lot. The three of cups in reverse. Even if they are, they do have this third party around them. This person could be somebody in a position of power with the emperor. What's the six of pentacles? Yeah, some of you feel like this person was like giving you like the bare minimum. Yeah. Yeah. And you want stability. You want something stable. Sagittarian energy here. Some of y'all feel like this person got a lot of pride. You think they, some of you think they could be a little bit arrogant, stubborn. Tell me more about this third party that's around them. You know I'm nosy. The death card. I feel like. I feel like they're not going to be fucking with this person much longer. The six of wands. This person be on a dick. The temperance. The emperor in reverse. Whoever this person is, they be like, the reason why, <laughs> see this person that's around them, this third party person, they be blowing up their phone. They the type of person that be thirsty. Texting them all the time. You know, always calling them, like showing up, like, this person, some of y'all, this person is famous. They could be in the public eye. They could be popular or they just get a lot of attention or something, or they're just very known. But whoever this other person is around them, they like, they like really like, they just be blowing this person up. I'm getting like, I just heard thirst bucket. If you don't know what a thirst bucket is, that's somebody who's just always calling, always texting, always showing up, like no self-awareness, no self-esteem, just, just throwing yourself at somebody kind of, that's who this person is. I don't, they're not in love with this person. It's not even a strong connection. I feel like they've known them for a while. And I feel like with the death card, that's Scorpio energy and Sagittarius with the temperance. I feel like, I feel like they have tried to like cut this person off. Is there anything else you need to know about this person? The high priestess, they feel like spiritually connected to you. Three of cups again in reverse. Yeah, we know, we know there's somebody else around them. We know the four cups. The wheel of fortune in reverse. You definitely met this person for a reason. Somebody has a calico cat. I love those. They're so cute. So pretty. I feel like with the four cups, they're not like, they know that you don't accept their behavior. You don't like their behavior. You don't like how you're being treated. Some of you, they may even think you got a third party because you've gone silent. Show me the realizations. Yeah, see, seven of swords in reverse. It's something, either you saw something, the five of pentacles. See, there's something that's making you fall back, disappear, go silent on this person. Something you saw, something you heard, something they did. Because it's like you, whoever you are, like you, you don't want to be stressed out. You don't want to have to worry, be stressed with, you keep getting the nine of swords in reverse. You don't want to be stressed. You don't want to worry. You don't, and you shouldn't. You don't want to have to have anxiety about someone. Like you want to feel secure. And this person's not giving you that security. What's the obscurity? Yeah, some of y'all, this person got a lot of money. Something about chocolate cake and wine here. Five of Pentacles again. You ain't playing with this person. You ain't playing with this person. Whoever you are, you respect yourself. There's something here about grapes too. Let me know if that resonates in the comments. There's something here about grapes too. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah. 
This person could be a Taurus, a Virgo, Capricorn. I just heard Lapsa Apso. Somebody could have that breed dog. What's the withdrawn card? The Magician. The Knight of Swords in reverse, the Justice in reverse. Yeah. You pull back because you feel like feel like this person is not treating you fairly with the justice in reverse could be a libra gemini here with the magician you feel like this person ain't treating you fairly like you might even feel like you was the only one really trying to like make things happen what's the pride card four of pentacles nine of wands in reverse the three of swords in reverse I mean, I feel like some of y'all in a way could be a little bit prideful, but it's only because, I mean, I don't even think it's pride. I think it's just, you just want to be respected. Like, you know what I mean? You just, you want this person to, you know, if you want me, then put your, you know, put your money where your mouth is. Show me. It's in your actions. It's not what you're saying. It's what you're doing. So I don't really even think that you... You know what I'm saying? Whoever this is, they could be used to like people always chasing after them. And you're just not like that. And I don't blame you. You shouldn't be like that. Like nobody should have to chase. We supposed to be doing this together. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So let's go into the extended. Let's see what's happening between you and this person in the future. We will pull Oracle. We'll pull Tarot. We'll get you some advice. Okay. Um, yeah. If you want to join me, the link is below in the description box. Okay. We'll see what's happening between you and this person in the future. If you want to book a personal one-on-one -on -one reading with me, you can email Miss Hawaii readings at gmail.com. My Instagram and my TikTok is Miss Hawaii Tarot. So definitely show love on there. And um, shout out to all the members, everybody who's a part of my Patreon. Thank you for your love and support on there. And if you want to join either one of those, that information is below as well. And uh, yeah, I am, I'm so thankful for all of you, for my YouTube family. You guys are awesome. I love you. I'm always praying for you. And thanks for always showing love. All right. Thank you for all your donations too. Somebody sent me a donation. I forget who it was. Let me shout this person out. Hold on. They sent it through PayPal. Was it through PayPal or was it through? Uh, do, 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 do. Might've been through, was it through Cash App or was it through PayPal? I don't know, it's not coming up. Let me see something. Hold on. Because I want to say thank you to this person. Um, wait, I think I just saw it. Do, do, do. Oh, yeah. FK. FK sent me $20. Said the, for last night's live was lit spot on the tea and fun. <laughs> so thank you to FK for that $20 cash app. Thank you, and I love you. Thank you to everybody who's ever sent me any donations, any gifts. I love you, all right? So thanks, FK, and thank you to Rita from my chips. Thank you, Rita, from my chips, girl. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the birthday gift. All right, I love y'all. I'll see y'all in the extended. <laughs> if not, I'll see you on the next one. Bye!